the following is an update and technical analysis on Eli Lilly, a company of the healthcare sector and drug manufacturers based upon the seven day interval. And obesity stocks and obesity itself may be within the beginning stages of converging at a peak here with a nice clean divergent high with bearish and negative divergence here within the seven day RSI handle and the price percent oscillator, which could be signaling a pivotal shift as GLP-1 drugs prove their power on a population scale, obesity rates are now dropping for the first time in decades, hinting at a new era of health. Yet just as Novo and Lilly stocks begin a correction, if not a falter, the market's once unshakable confidence is beginning to wane with whispers of competition, short sellers lurking, and ambitious projections for these miracle drugs beyond weight loss, the stakes are high. If and when history repeats, this could potentially mark a transformative inflection point in public health, just like the fall of smoking. And within the daily realm, we are within the beginning stages of reflecting upon its 200-day moving average. Long traders and or bull traders would really need to hold this counterintuitive inflection point to hold off any short sellers with a complete gap, an unchecked gap up above potentially setting some major stop signals below its previous reactionary low there. We'll call it the 177213 mark in confluence to go on to rechallenge that gap and 50-day moving average resistance level, ultimately rechallenging major reactionary highs up above for a 25% rally. Long traders will be within the beginning stages of rechallenging major big-time pivot reflection points. Short sellers are salivating out the mouth now with a confirmed breakdown sell signal Going back in mid-July here with a nice clean divergent high, you had an additional big-time divergent high with negative and bearish divergences really constructing here on all four key technical momentum indicators. Now only having a complete distribution of consolidation on a solid big breakdown, additional sell signal, completely gapped down, broke that trend support level, and, is, and we are now retesting the 200-day moving average. I have signaled some additional dollar cost average levels here with an unfilled and unchecked gap down below the six. 6790-ish level that would be an additional big time resistance and or support level for long traders and or bull traders to hold you have additional big time support at the 61775 level and then additional 56051 for another 30 percent correction there and that would be the ultimate test on the line with further damage beginning to construct in which you would have a complete death cross bearish moving average convergence there with the 50 day moving average undercuts its 200 day and that would spark additional damage where you have huge volume sell spike sell spikes in volume that has yet to be witnessed on a scale uh, that of this magnitude going back back to the span of time of 2021 volume levels when the glp1 trials were complete and an all-out fixated huge spark in positive momentum that some of the glp1 drugs actually offered weight loss promising trials and that was a huge spark in that rally Huge volume and present that was good for geared up for 443% gains to the upside. Wall Street rivaled artificial intelligence with the GLP-1 train leaving the station for weight loss drugs, which is really dubbed by the Wall Street Journal as the king of weight loss drugs. Make no mistake about it, side effects and any other additional challenges and competition could prove. Guy Lilly's price to earnings ratio has surged around the 89 handle as of the end of October were significantly surpassing its whole historical average of the 50 range handle. The elevated PE ratio could reflect traders and investors optimism driven by the company's advancements in GLP-1 drugs, notably Manjaro and Zepbound, which have shown promises in treating obesity and related conditions. However, with recent earnings reports have fallen short of expectations, leading to this additional decline and negative divergence. The technical structure of the stock leaned in and gave us those short clues before the earnings report. Where this discrepancy between high valuation and performance underscores the market's anticipation of future growth tempered by immediate challenges and in the grand narrative of pharmaceutical innovation eli Lilly stands at a crossroads here off a key inflection point where the company's high valuation is a potential testament to its potential to revolutionize healthcare yet the path forward it's fraught with challenges that will test its resilience and capacity to fulfill these lofty expectations